What's going on you guys? This is MXKDI, another Toshiba Tecra W50A laptop. This is a workstation. I'll show you guys the front. It's got an i7 processor here, pretty nice. It's got 8 gigs of memory, so I'm going to be upgrading the memory to uh, total 32 gigs, and I'm going to upgrade to another solid state drive and show you guys how to do that. Let me show the show, close it up and look at the back side. And what you need is a Phillips screwdriver mini and they remove the side right here, the, the memory cover here it's held by two screws here and so we remove the solid state drive and I'm going to install another one in here, it's a 2.5 inch thin you can use now memory upgrade right here, it's got 8 gigs in here, so it's total 4 gig per each slot. I'm going to zoom in the camera show you guys how to do that. Upgrade to memory. And, and here's the memory we're going to be installing. It's a, it's a DDR3-1600 memory in here, it's a laptop memory. Again, DDR3-1600, it's a laptop memory. And so we install it. It's got it's using eight gig per each slot total. And the way you remove the memory, there's a clips right here. You press it right here, clip right here, and right and one and left right here. Really easy to remove, and it comes right out. Really easy. So we just upgraded the memory, guys, to uh, 16 gigs. And another 16 gigs is gonna be in front of where the, the keyboard is. Show you guys how to do that and. Let me move this away, this one in here. And let me show, close the side cover here. So it's got 16 gigs, now we're going to have to add more 16 more, and it's going to be in this side right here where the keyboard is. And the way you do that, let me zoom out the camera, you guys can see better. And let's see, what we're going to do is, right here you see the little hole right here i'm going to zoom in the camera where you guys can see better you need a screwdriver with the flat head a little mini screwdriver and what you're going to do right here or you you use your nail right here just you remove the clip right here line a clip right here and to remove that be really really careful holes by the clips and what you're going to do is there's little clips right here. You release the keyboard. I'm trying to go around it. One over here. So there'll be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The clips is hold by little secure clips. You gotta press them up to release them really easy to release the keyboard and just lift it up and it comes right out and this is where the memory cover right here is so we're gonna add six uh, two slots right here that we're gonna add 16 more gigs of, so it's 8 gig per slot and here's the memory right here that we're supposed to add and we have been, uh, I'm adding 8 more gigs per each slot so here's uh, 8 Another eight right here. And here's another eight. Last one. So guys, it's total uh, we added total 16 gigs. So that's six gigs, 16 gigs right here, and a 16 we added the other back side. And we're gonna put close the side, put the plate back on. That's it, then now we're going to install the memory back, the keyboard right here, and it clips right in, I really like it, it doesn't really hold by any screws here, real nice, I like this laptop, pretty nice la workstation, so let me zoom out the camera, and you're going to install back the
Make sure when you guys do upgrade, I forgot to tell you guys, make sure you uh, to remove the battery. Because my battery in here is this, uh, it's not charged at all, it's, the battery is dead, so that's why I did not remove the battery. But if your battery is fully charged, does have uh, power to it, make sure you remove it. So I'll show you guys how to do that again. So remove this clip right, pull it back on here, and it clips right in here, really easy, really quick. Just like that. And close this up, I'll show you guys, before you guys are going to do upgrade, make sure you remove the battery. Because I forgot to show you guys how to do that. And move the clip here to remove the battery. Like this. Because my battery in here is dead. It's not charged at all. It has no power to it. But, uh, but you guys, before you do upgrade, make sure you move the battery. So, you guys, this is the end of the video. Put the battery back on here. But if your battery does has no power to it, it's completely dead, then you don't have to remove it. But, uh, so, you guys, this is it. This is for the Toshiba Tecra W58. We upgrade the memory to 32 gigs. And we upgrade to different Soul State Drive. Thanks for watching. Bye.